Hello everybody and welcome to some redstone. Now, um, before I, uh, show you anything, do know that, um, <clears throat> limitations in Minecraft mechanics and in my own redstone knowledge have made it so this piece isn't perfect. This is just a proof of concept type of thing, even though it's probably been done before, but let's dive right into it. So what I've made, as you've probably seen in the title, is painting in Minecraft. Now, as you can see, I've already painted something, and... Uh, yeah, let's just dive right into it. So, um, let's make a green bottom. Let's paint some green. And then on this one, perfect. This is perfect. Um, then let's do a blue sky above that. So basically what this is, is you stand on top of your little artist's painting thing to get some colors and then you can uh where you walk on the painting canvas if you <clears throat> if I may and you paint and I mean it's pretty simple uh you, let's just finish up I think this is good for this guy anyways I was just showing you guys what this is and as you can see it's not painting underneath me or anything like that and uh this could <laughs> I'm not a very good painter with this, but <clears throat> yeah. So I don't know. This I thought that this would be pretty cool. This is normally like my first. This is one of my first like proof of concepts, really. And once again, I know that it's probably already been done, but I did want to try it out myself just to get my redstone skills up. But basically, what is going on here is um this clock is testing for. Oops. It I assume it's this one, right? This is testing for if there is a wool block underneath the player. And if there is, then it's going to set a redstone block over here in the corresponding, um, uh, I don't know, area. So this would set one right here, this would set one right here, and so on. And this sets a scoreboard operation. Uh, let's see if I can pull it up here, so the sidebar, I believe it's color, yeah, so right now it's currently selected to 7, and that is the, um, that corresponds to which color I choose, so here this should be 0, 1, 10, 11, 14, 18, 13, 4, and 15, they're not in order, because I was actually just using the, uh, little, uh, I did random rules instead of doing every single color just to make this easier. And so it's not going to, uh, 0 through 15, it's a little bit random, but moving on, uh, over here, this is testing to see if this, uh, the sidebar is set to a certain color. So right now, it is saying that it is set to black, or 15, and if it is, then it is going to clone this area, a certain part of this area, depending on which one it is and it will uh, uh, goodness paste it right here to the corresponding um, uh, where it just where it needs to go and this so like um, don't don't mind about these two these two are just testing to see if there's air underneath me just so then I just so then there isn't a bunch of wool carpet in this air and stuff like that um, <clears throat> but as you can see, so this is where black is, and it will, uh, because this is selected, or even without the, uh, comparators right there, it is executing, it's looking for a block of quartz right underneath the player. And currently, the canvas has a bunch of blocks, of, blocks of quartz underneath, which is this little, uh, wool, uh, lip on the edge, just to catch any paint or any things, so, uh, yeah, basically, as you can see right here, this is what it was doing, and, <clears throat> sorry, I'm a little bit sick, so, I don't, I try, I'm trying not to talk, talk too much, but, uh, then, that, what that's gonna do, if there is a comparator there, then it'll send its signal over to here, which will clone, uh, this block over to this clock, as you can see, this is for black, and it goes on up. I just put it uh, at a slant, so then it could just clone straight 
across, and it would be practically the same um, coordinates for each clone, except moving one more in the Y position, I believe that's what it was. So, or Z, uh, Z position. And it's just going to put it here, and this will just uh, execute by putting a carpet block where you are standing. So it's fairly simple. And as you can see, I did just I did jump up over here, so there is some carpet in the air. But normally, I like to just walk off to prevent that from happening. But oh, that's kind of weird. I must have gone too fast. Anyway, yeah, that's all there is to it. Oh, that's nothing, by the way. That's all there is to it. And until um, the next episode, guys. See you later.